Good evening, and welcome to the snow day edition of our video blog. Uh, today our classes were canceled because of an ice storm, and as you can hear, uh, the it sounds really terrible out there, and it's just a terrible ice storm. Actually, those are just sound effects, and actually, um, our classes were canceled. All of Dallas was shut down for this ice storm that didn't come till about 8 o'clock tonight. But actually, it is icing out there right now, and it's kind of bad, and we don't know whether uh, we're going to have classes tomorrow. But it's kind of funny, even though that uh, we're not, we're really enjoying our classes, it's still fun to have classes canceled. It's like getting a snow day when you were in school growing up, and so it was still pretty fun to have the day off for, for an ice storm. And also probably because uh, I've heard that the folks out here don't really know how to drive in the ice and in the snow, and so it would be kind of scary to be out there. But we've had a good day at home, getting lots of work done, and we're excited about the next uh, few days. Yesterday we had a short, um, keep your toboggan on, we had a short uh, one-day seminar in interpersonal relationships with Dr. Steve Allison. Uh, he's the one who did our psych our psychology tests or our personality tests a year and a half ago to decide whether we could do this at all in the first place. And he brought all those in and is kind of going over um, our different personality profiles and how we can work together as a team. So that's been really interesting and will be really helpful in the future um, with, with all the stuff that we're going to do, especially as we're working together as a team. He was supposed to teach us today, um, but because of the ice storm, he wasn't able to and he had to be out of town. So they'll reschedule him for later uh, in our sixth month, six month period. Tomorrow we have a one day seminar on missionary wives, which is kind of cool because uh, it's going to be taught by Georgia Freitas, uh, one of the women on staff here. And I don't know exactly what the class is going to be on, but my, my guess, and I think this is true, it's going to be to help us understand what the ladies will be facing on the mission field. And you might wonder, well, why do the guys have to be a part of that? It's probably going to be good for us, for we insensitive men, to understand what these ladies are going to be going through and the transition they're going to be facing as women on the mission field. So that'll be tomorrow, and that ought to be really interesting. And, of course, we have Spanish class uh, every day as well. On Thursday and Friday, we're in for a treat. Retired Brigadier General Jim Brickman is going to be with us. He uh, works with the teams. In fact, he's going to be working with us this whole six-month period. He'll come in for two-day uh, periods of time every few weeks and help us with vision, strategy, strategy, and policy on the mission field. They say he's really organized, but that he's really good with this vision stuff, and he's a retired Army Brigadier General. So that'll be kind of that'll be good, and we're looking forward to that. Uh, that's what's going on the rest of this week. Next week, we're going to, we're going to be at the Freed Hardeman Lectureship, so I'm sure we'll see some of you there. and uh, hope, that, hope that we see some of you there and find us if you're there because we'll be there. We're leaving here on Saturday. Continent of Great Cities has given us the entire week uh, to be there because a lot of our supporters are going to be there. We're also going to be sending out a newsletter later this week. Uh, that should happen Friday, um, so that will give you an update. However, if you read our blog, a lot of the information will be repetitive. Uh, let me say thanks for checking the blog um, and for watching these videos. The, the website we're using actually has a counter so we can see how many people are looking at it. And a lot of people are looking at, looking at it and that means a lot because it says to us that people care what we're doing and they, they're interested um, in seeing, seeing what's going on in our lives. And hopefully they're praying for us because we need your prayers so we're thankful uh, for that. As the video closes, uh, after I go off, I'm going to show you a video I took, a real brief deal, not but 30 seconds or so, of the ducks that live behind our apartment. I promise you the video I'm taking is literally out our back steps of our apartment. Hundreds of ducks. It's kind of wild, uh, so I'll show you that video. For those of you hunters and many of our supporters are from rural places and you like to hunt, some of you like to hunt ducks, I know, if Justin Shirley happens to watch this, uh, he will appreciate all of these ducks. I would estimate, I don't think I got all of them one shot, three to four hundred of those ducks down there every afternoon. There's a lady here who feeds them. Thank you for your prayers. Uh, for those of you who have and are supporting us right now, uh, we thank you a whole bunch. Um, it really means a lot. And... Uh, uh, so this ends the uh, snow day ice storm version uh, episode of the blog. Uh, 
Hope everybody has a great week, and we'll be praying for you. Thanks for all your help.